Hello everyone, this is Jay at Inspiration Masters. We are a communication leadership training institute based in the United States. As a part of our education series, we invite the educators from around the world who are specialized in several fields and they can bring us the highest and the best quality information presented in a very simple language, easy to understand, easy to apply immediately, and at the same time, in the shortest period of time. So again, uh, welcome to the education series. Get ready to get some great information and let's find out who our guest is today. I have a very special guest here with me and she is an expert on etiquette. I have with me Ms. Ramya Inugu. She is an Emily Post certified etiquette coach. And uh, welcome, Ramya, to Inspiration Masters. Thank you so much, Jay. Uh, it's my pleasure. <laughs> and um, it, it's so glad, I'm so glad to have you here because in, in our routine, we do a lot of things. And some of the things which we do, I think, I wish we would have done it differently. And it could be something as small as uh, having our headphones on while we talk to somebody else. And sometimes it is... Uh, that we're not showing up on time. Or some of the times, the way we speak, the way we talk, the way we do things, we don't have eye contact sometimes, looking on the sides, that's possible. All of, there are so many things which are happening. So I want to see that uh, we find out the right way to do things. So that is the reason, friends, I'm here uh, with uh, Ms. Ramya. She is an expert and she can tell us a whole lot about what are the things uh, we should be doing in different situations. Today, I have one question for you, a very simple question, which is each and every one of us come across that. How important is it is to be on time? It's a very good question to start off with, Jay, uh, punctuality. Uh, I believe that punctuality has a notion of an age-old practice, but uh, I think I believe it is still relevant to this day and time because uh, punctuality is one of the wonderful traits of a person. Uh, it it uh, helps in uh, showing that you respect others' time and also themselves, right? Mm -hmm. So uh, punctuality also, is, uh, also shows that a person is organized and organized, being organized is one of the uh, leadership traits. Mm -hmm. uh, so uh, definitely punctuality uh, helps you in becoming a professional in a professional setting because it shows you as a trustworthy and a reliable person and helps you stand out in a group. Uh, also, uh, punctuality is related to the three principles of etiquette, which is respect, uh, mm -hmm. honesty, and consideration. Because when you when you're punctual, you're respecting others' time, and you also gain respect in return, and you're mm -hmm. considerate. And also you're honest. Uh, the honesty part comes in when when you're getting late because life happens. Huh? Things happen in life. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You get late sometimes. And when you're getting late, trying to inform the person about it in a very short message or a call briefly about what time you're uh, planning to arrive will be a very good option. Being honest about it and rather lying and saying that I'm on my way or something uh, like that. Yes. That's correct. <laughs> Oh, those those are very important things. Yeah, so those things are the part of the etiquettes that uh, how we do things, and that is impacting. And then the other thing which, which I really liked about what you say that you have to be in a professional setting, you have to be reliable. So if you're going to be late, yeah, it can happen, life can happen, but you need to inform the other people uh, what to expect. So that is a good thing. There are three things you mentioned, and I would like to repeat all the three of those. One is respect for the other people, being honest and having consideration. So uh, again, uh, uh, let's go ahead and repeat one more time. So all of us get into the mode that, hey, uh, things can happen, but is it okay to be late? Probably not, that's to begin with. But then what happens next? Okay, so tell us uh, one more time about all the three things we need to be very careful for being on time or if we are not what we do. It, it is important that because it shows, uh, first of all, you become a wonderful person because it's a very good trait to be. Yes. Mm -hmm. And the second is, uh, you, it shows that you are organized and you respect others' time. And yes. also it helps 
stand out, uh, showing you as a reliable and trustworthy person. Yes, and then, then we do come across people who we count on, right? People yeah. set up their timings on them. They're so yes. punctual all the time. So that is that is something interesting. And I have seen people those who are people set up their watches according to the person yeah. being seen. They say, "Oh, wow, this person has showed up. So it must be nine o'clock." Period. And so that's that's how it can be. So again, that was very interesting thing to know from you about uh, keeping and being on time. So, friends, it's very important to be on time at all the time. So this is Jade Inspiration Masters. Thank you for watching, and subscribe. Hit the like button, share with other people. Just make sure that uh, the education series is on at all times. Um, so you are getting this, all this information coming to you. And Mr. Ramya, thank you so much uh, for this information. Uh, we'll be talking to you very soon and finding out more things about the etiquette when you get an opportunity to come here. So you're always welcome here at Inspiration Masters. Again, thanks for watching. Uh, we'll see you soon.